A prelate is a high-ranking member of the clergy who is an ordinary or who ranks in precedence with ordinaries. The word derives from the Latin prelatus, the past participle of prefer, which means, carry before, be set above or over, or prefer, hence, a prelate is one set over others. The archetypal prelate is a bishop, whose prelature is his particular church. All other prelates, including the regular prelates such as abbots and major superiors, are based upon this original model of prelacy. Related terminology In a general sense, a «prelate» in the Catholic Church and other Christian churches is a bishop or other ecclesiastical person who possesses ordinary authority of a jurisdiction, i.e., of a diocese or similar jurisdiction, e.g., ordinariates, apostolic vicariates, exarchates, or territorial abbacies. It equally applies to cardinals, who enjoy a kind of co-governance of the universal church as the most senior ecclesiastical advisors and moral representatives of the supreme pontiff, and certain superior prelates of the offices of the Roman Curia, who are not bishops, e.g. the auditors judges of the Holy Roman Rota and Protonotaries Apostolic. By extension, it refers to inferior or lesser prelates, that is priests who have the title and dress of prelates as a personal honorific, I. E. Papal chaplains, prelates of honor, formerly domestic prelates, and honorary protonotaries apostolic. All these enjoy the title of Monsignor, which also is used in some nations for bishops and archbishops. The seven de numero protonotaries apostolic in Rome, who are special papal notaries, are true prelates like bishops, others are supernumerary. Protonotaries apostolic who enjoy this as an honorific, like papal chaplains and prelates of honor. In the strict canonical sense, prelate denominates a priest or bishop who is ordinary of a personal prelature see below, which is a functional equivalent of a diocese that has a particular pastoral or missionary work for various regions or for different social groups. Cf. Code of Canon Law, Canon 294 yet no territorial jurisdiction. In the Armenian Apostolic Orthodox Church, prelate in English denominates a diocesan bishop, whose jurisdiction of his diocese is denominated a prelacy. Territorial prelatures In the Catholic Church, a territorial prelate is a prelate whose geographic jurisdiction, denominated a territorial prelature, is outside of and therefore not subject to any diocese. A territorial prelate is sometimes denominated a prelate nullius, from the Latin nullius dioecesios, prelate of no diocese, denoting that his territory is directly subject to the Holy See the Supreme Pontiff and is not a diocese. As of 2013, there were 44 territorial prelatures, all of which were in the Latin Church. The term also is used generically, in which case it may equally refer to an apostolic prefecture, an apostolic vicariate, or a territorial abbacy. Personal prelatures In the Catholic Church, the personal prelature was conceived during the Second Vatican Council in No. 10 of the Decree Presbyterorum Ordinis and B.L. Pope Paul VI later enacted it into law in the Motu Proprio Ecclesia Sancte. The institution was later reaffirmed in the Code of Canon Law of 1983. Such a prelature is an institution having clergy and, possibly, lay members which would execute specific pastoral activities. The adjective, personal, refers to the fact that, in contrast with previous canonical use for ecclesiastical institutions, the jurisdiction of the prelate is not territorial and instead is of specific persons wherever they are located. The establishment of personal prelatures is an exercise of the theological inherent power of self-organization which the Church has in order to pursue its mission, though a personal prelature is not a particular Church, as are dioceses and military ordinariates. Personal prelatures are fundamentally secular organizations operating in the world members do not take vows and live normal, everyday lives, whereas religious institutes are religious organizations operating out of the world members take vows and live in accordance with the proper law of their institute. 
The first, and presently only, personal prelature is Opus Dei, which Pope St. John Paul II erected as such in 1982 by the Apostolic Constitution Ut Sit. In the case of Opus Dei, the prelate is elected by members of the prelature and confirmed by the Supreme Pontiff. The laity and clergy of the prelature remain subject to the government of the particular churches in whose territory they live, and the laity associated with the prelature, both men and women, are organically united under the jurisdiction of the prelate. Controversies regarding retired prelates As of 15 February 2018, a motu proprio issued by Pope Francis ordered prelates and bishops to live simply and renounce any desire for power after they retire from senior offices of the Roman Curia. A number of such officials and bishops have been criticized in recent years for luxurious living, such as having large apartments and police escorts after they retired. One notable incident involved an apartment that Tarsicio Cardinal Bertoni, an Italian prelate and former Cardinal Secretary of State who was removed in 2013, used, and which had been renovated at the cost of nearly half a million dollars of funds that were diverted from a Vatican-owned hospital. Even after he retired, Tarsicio Cardinal Bertoni was seen using escorts of Vatican City and Italian police to move around Rome. See also. Topic. Catholic Church Hierarchy Section Equivalence of Diocesan Bishops in Law Ordinariate for the Faithful of Eastern Rite Personal Ordinariate Topic. References Topic.